Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm unboxing my favorite food subscription box and this is Universal Yums. For those of you who don't know, Universal Yums is a monthly foreign subscription box that sends you snacks and sweets from different countries around the world. They do have three different box sizes. They have a yum box, a yum yum box, and a super yum box. The yum box is $15 a month and you get six plus snacks. The yum yum box is $25 a month for 12 plus snacks. And this right here is the super yums box which gives you 20 plus snacks for $39 a month. If you are interested I do have a referral code that I'll leave down in the description box below and if you're into subscription boxes go ahead and subscribe. And I will say that if you are signing up as of today you do have the option to choose either this box which is Thailand or you can get last month's box which is from the United Kingdom. So anyway we'll go ahead and get right into this video and I will say that I am not trying any of the snacks because I do not want to be wasteful. I actually already tried one though but that's okay. So anyway this is their box for July. This is from Thailand and it says the land of smiles. So I'm going to go ahead and open it and then when you open it it does have a little pamphlet on top that shows Thailand and then it has a ranking so you can go ahead and choose what snacks you like the best so favorite worst and weirdest and if you take a picture of this and post it on social media you have the chance to win extra snacks and then it just tells you about some items that did not make it in the box and then vote on an upcoming box so it's pretty cool that they do that and then there is a booklet that goes over all of the items it does also have like some trivia but i usually use this so i know what i'm talking about and then here is what the box looks like. So we're going to go ahead and get started. Okay, so the first item out of the box is in this little pouch right here. And these are salty lime gummies, which is definitely interesting. I would never think for like salt and lime together, but I guess it's like that with margaritas. But like in a candy form, it seems kind of interesting. But all right, we will continue. The next item is in this packaging right here. It is a seaweed wrapped potato stick with fried shrimp and mayo flavor. Definitely intrigued by this. The shrimp part sounds really cool. Next is actually like an item that you put in the microwave and it's ready to eat. So this is actually kind of cool to get in the box. This is mango sticky rice with coconut cream. And this actually sounds really, really good. So it says it's ready to eat 15 seconds in the microwave for better taste. That is very cool. You could also soak it in a hot pouch or you could also soak it in the pouch in hot water for five minutes or just eat it as is. Very cool. I wonder if this will be good. I'm not super into rice, but if it's like fruity, I'll probably be more into it. But the next item ooh, is a banana coconut roll. And that just sounds really, really good. And there's more than one in the pack, which is nice. So you can eat them all yourself or you can share. Moving on to some chips. We have a little bag of sweet garlic wheat crisps. So they're sweet and spicy, apparently, which sounds good as well. There's also, here we go back to the salt. We have some salty lemon potato chips. Very cool, lemon potato chips. Definitely unique. Oh, these will be intense. Thai chili pepper potato chips. Oh, I can only imagine how hot these are. There's like peppers all over the bag. This will definitely be something you need to have a drink nearby. Moving on to something sweet, there's salted caramel coconut chips in this bag right here. And this is a really decent size. It's, what is it? 1.41 ounces. All right. It looks bigger than what it actually shows, but okay. The next item is actually a bigger pouch for real this time. It's wafer cubes with honey toast flavored cream. Honey is probably good. That's a very unique combination, but ooh, I'm up for it. So the next is dried seaweed with chicken flavor. Should be very interesting. This is a decent size too, but hmm, dried seaweed with chicken flavor. I've tried regular seaweed before and I'll be honest, I was not the biggest fan, but chicken flavor, I'll give it a try. So now we have three mixed chips. It comes with taro sticks, purple yam chips, and sweet potato chips. These will probably be really, really good. And then moving on to something sour. Sour blueberry gummy straws. Ooh, blueberry. Blueberry is always good. Then there's some crab curry potato chips. Sounds very unique. But apparently this is the main course in Thailand, so it must be very popular there. 
Next is a sweet corn coconut roll. So we had a banana roll and now we have a sweet corn one, which is very intriguing for sure. And this is actually the item that I've already opened just because it looks delicious. They are biscuits with pineapple jam. And what's really cool about this is when you open it, they are individually packaged and they are shaped like little pineapples. These were really, really good. I enjoyed these a lot. And then the next item is dried okra chips with soy sauce flavor. And it comes in this packaging right here. And then the last thing in this box is a little yum bag, which gives you a couple different candies. So I'm going to go ahead and get this open. Okay, so this month it looks like there are four different candies, but they do give you like multiples with of each. I really don't want them to fall out. But the first one is a pineapple hard candy with a salt center. So there definitely is like a salty theme here with the candy, which is definitely unique. Then there is a steamed banana chew, which is right here, and it does feel like it's nice and soft. Then there is also a sweet corn chew, which is unique. And then a sour candy. This is a sour cola candy. Hmm. So it definitely seems like there's a theme with like coconut, salt, and corn which is very interesting. I will say that I feel like this box is a little bit more out of my comfort zone, which I'm actually kind of excited about at first. I was like, oh geez, some of this stuff sounds very interesting. But now that like I'm reading it and really looking into it, I'm actually excited to try all of this. I think I am most excited to try, ooh, I kind of want to try the wafer cubes with the honey toast flavored cream. And the crab curry potato chip sounds good. I don't know about the curry part, but the crab part sounds really good. But that brings me to the end of this video. This is everything that you would get in the Super Yum box for this month. Again, if you are interested, I do have a referral code down below. Go ahead and comment down below. And let me know if you subscribe to this box and you've tried any of the snacks. And if not, comment down below. And let me know what would be most interesting to try in your opinion. But thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.